Hello and welcome to Holy Potatoes. What the hell? So, a while back, I don't remember exactly how long ago it was, I did a video on Holy Potatoes, a weapon shop. And it was ludicrously fun and insanely addicting to the point where I, uh, I don't exactly remember how far I was, but I, oh goodness, hello Mr. I don't know what was going on in the background there. But, going off track, the, uh, a weapon shop was fun and hilarious. And the developer actually emailed me a couple of days ago and gave me a full Steam key, or a Steam key to the full game. I know how words work, and I was gonna do a video on it for Halloween. But Hollow Knight they're getting a Halloween update, and I'm literally not going to do anything but that. So then I was going to do it for my next Red Eye session. But then I remembered Destiny. I'm going to do that. So I says, I says to myself, fuck it. I'm going to do it today. So, just because of that, I have not looked at, into this game at all. As far as knowing that I am some sort of chef in hell, and I've got to do stuff. So we're going to go on a learning adventure together, guys. Ah, yes, the kitchen. It gave me life. But it also took my life and everything I ever had. That hurt. There's a nice smell from there. Ooh, you've really upped your animations. <laughs> ah, space to continue. Is that? Oh, okay. I gotta do something. There. If a game has a custom cursor, of course I want to have it showing. Where am I? What is this place? Hey! Hey, you! I'm a woman and I should have a higher pitched voice! Oh god, I'm clipping. There. Yes, I'm talking to you. Why are you wandering about? It's time to fall in. What's your name? My name? Oh, wait. Ugh, that's right. Memories wiped. What do you want me to call you? Sweeney Tots. <laughs> oh god. I love it already. Oh, I want to edit my flag. What can I do? I can do text, I can... Okay. Oh no, oh no. Uh, there we go. A reset button. Hold on. What? Can I? No. Uh, duh. Oh, right click to remove the logo item. Oh. Cut up that. <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. Okay. I'm gonna be here a while. <laughs> okay, I know it's a little goofy, but. Damn it, I. F uh, it, 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 it sums it up. I'm feeling a little giddy already. It's funny. Uh, Sweeney Tots. Uh, I like that. I should have kept it. Um. Uh, I 
don't, I don't, I don't know what, all right. I don't know how to spell it. I'm going to keep it at Sweeney Tots. And I'll keep with PSI Friday. I can only imagine what it stands for. Sweeney Tots? That's an odd name. Whatever, get in line. You're late enough as it is. Wah? What's going on? Listen up, fresh batch. Uh, she's pointing directly into my soul. My name is Taming Brock, Brock Oliver, and I'm the sous chef and manager of this joint. First things first, welcome to hell! That's right, y'all are dead. It's A-A-E-D. Kaboom! Squished! Mashed! <laughs> Your spelling's a little off. What? Did I say you could speak? The audacity! Thank the devil you're already dead, or you would wish you were. So anyway, yep. Basically, y'all are given a chance to prove your worth down here as chefs. She doesn't want me to speak, but I'm going to. <laughs> we're going to be cooking? Yes, and all of you will be assuming the role of gatekeeper chefs, the unholy protectors of hell. Wait. Why aren't you changed into your uniforms yet? Let me just do this. Oh, such a maze. Much better. You lot are now in charge of processing the sinners through various methods of torture, which includes frying, boiling, mashing, baking. Oh, that sounds absolutely delicious, doesn't it? Oh, am I gonna say it? You'll be going through the nine circles of hell. The first circle is right where we are now, in limbo. This is where sinners wander about aimlessly for their sins too small. The deeper levels of hell. I skip words when I speak sometimes, but too big for the clouds of heaven. You may think, oh, this doesn't look like hell. Where are the demons? Where are the fiery flames of purgatory? Well, not every circle is the same. The mainstream media only ever shows the circle of anger because they deem it most hellish. Pah! If you spuds are lucky, you may just get to visit the other circles and you'll see them for yourselves. Yes, y'all be slogging around in this hot, stuffy kitchen right over here. Follow me. Hey, you. Hi! The name's Vegel. This is Dante. I just met her now. Hi, welcome to the Circus of Torment and Misery. No, Dante, that's not the right attitude to have on your first day. What's your name? Uh, Sweeney Tots. Nice to meet you, Sweeney Tots. I know both of you might be a little confused right now. I was too when I first got here. Don't worry, it'll be fine. We just have to follow simple instructions. Got it? Good. I know y'all are new, but I expect nothing less than perfection, especially if you're under my command. Right. So here's your task list and objective for this circle, lads. Aprons up and get cooking. Um. Oh, oops. Did you get everything she said? Hmm. Uh, I'm miserable in this circle of hell already. No matter! I'm kind of familiar with how things are run. I can show you guys the ropes. Ah. <laughs> ah, the little face up in the corner. First, we'll need to sort the evil potatoes. This is the Sinner's Profile page. It shows you all the information you need about this nasty spot. Over here states the sinner's name and what his heinous crimes he or she has committed. I seduced my secretary. She was as hot as a pepper. Oh, Tony Starch. And here's how the potato sin is measured. M is for malice, P is for pride, G is for greed, A is for apathy. Now, let's assign this sinner to our torture stations. 
Those are random things. Oh, a deep fryer. The fryer will turn our sinners into fried potatoes. Only if the malice stat is higher than 50. Hover over the stations to learn about their requirements. Minimum requirement malice is 50. Level 1, 5 seconds, and 99 durability, probably. Now let's do the same with the rest of our stations. Remember, hover to check their requirements. Continue to sort the sinners. I got an achievable. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, daylight. The, uh, the names you come up with are awesome. Okay, so we got a basic oven for apathy. We got a basic masher for G, which was greed. And that for pride. Well, I guess we're boiling Laura Craft. Wait! No! She was an important person in, in a weapon shop. No, Laura, what have you done? Good job! That center is an excellent match for that station. Oh, greed. Oh, well, I'm gonna have to throw you to the masher. Uh, uh, Piter Parkour. Oh, goodness. I killed my uncle. He tried to teach me about power. Oh, that bastard. Peter, not the uncle. Oh, Joan Snow. I slept with my aunt. I know nothing. Huh. References. Ones that I don't necessarily know. Uh, I do believe that's Game of Thrones, but... I'm gonna say it now. Never watched it. Never read it. Never played it. So, Game of Thrones references are gonna go over my head. Wow, you're a natural. Time has been frozen while you were sorting. Let's resume to start the process. You can change the autopause setting in the options menu. Oh yeah, now we wait. Congratulations! You've just produced your first batch of ingredients. Well, this game just took an interesting twist. You can check your ingredient stock here. It is best to keep generating ingredients during prep time so you have enough to work with later on. Keep sorting. Service time is coming soon. Oh, uh, okay, so I want apathy, I want pride, uh, insulted a stranger was fun. Oh, good job, Jonathan. It's service time! <laughs> New dish to order, guest, <laughs> oh, God, it's Loki. Oh, I'm loving this game already. Looks like we have a guest god, he wants potato soup. All right, let's find potato soup in the recipe book. <laughs> oh. Dear Virgil, or Vegil, I think his name was Vegil, I think I found it with the little arrow pointing over it, so... Hey look, it's potato soup! What a surprise. There are ingredients needed for the dish. Once you have better ingredients later, you can click on icons to change its quality. Now we have everything in place. Let's start cooking. Oh, keep a lookout for the patience levels of the deities. If they run out of patience, they might penalize you. You can keep generating new ingredients while cooking. Oh, okay. So let's get a pride going. Or let's get a, a fryer and apathy. The dish is done. Mmm, smells amazing. Let's visit the god's altar. I've got an altar to Loki right here. All right. Now let's complete his order. Present as tribute. Ah. <laughs> Gotta get this up on Instagram. <laughs> Yay! You have been awarded with favor for the good service. Favor is given by the gods when their order is complete. If you fail the order, you will lose favor. Keep collecting favor to finish the objective. You need to he have at least 20 favor by the end of the day. Ah. Ah. Oh. Ah, uh, uh, well, good thing I've got 22. Thanks, Loki. And that's it. We've completed this stage. You seem to be getting the hang of it. Let's start our real shift. Damn. All right.
I can't really recreate Tom Hiddleston's voice, so I'm gonna give my own Loki voice. You there. Help me take a photo. Uh, uh, sure. Make sure to get my good side, yeah? Yes, you do your little dance there, Loki. Fantastic. Let me see. Th that isn't the right angle. You! Me. Take another one for me. Uh... Someone's been in the mead a little bit. Uh, let me see. Mm, this isn't too bad. You. Give it a try. Oh. Uh, let's zoom in till his face fills the entire screen. Uh, although it is the trickster god, so I could use the potato dog filter. We'll zoom on in his face. Yes, how do you like this, Loki? Let me see. Whoa, this isn't bad at all. Sweet photog skills. <laughs> Can we get you anything to drink, sir? Hmm, call me Loki. The Loki. Oh, uh, aren't you the son of Odin? Oh, you know my old pops, eh? Of course, I've heard whispers about the ruler of Valhalla. Yep, I'm the infamous, or should I say, since the grand famous, adopted son. Oh, sorry, that wasn't her. That was for, uh, Vegel. Whoa! <laughs> huh. I like you guys. <laughs> I'll upload the pic on Instagram for my followers. You guys are bound to have an influx of customers soon. <laughs> Which hashtag do you want me to use? I... Hashtag thanks Satan, it's Friday! Cause that's what I think your acronym is. Of course, I'm going to add hashtag Loki, hashtag Loki for some fun. Hashtag up all night to get Loki. And everyone's asleep. And done. No need to thank me. I'm only doing my part for the community. <laughs> um, okay, that's real nice of you. Oh, and about that drink. A Bali's, please. On the rocks. Hey, there's nothing wrong with Bailey's. Granted, I tend to drink my alcohols neat, but hey, earn fi and keep 50 favor in three days. All right, I got new music and carrot. Well, now that we're done with the tutorial, let's try the real thing. All right, so let's put you in there, and you can do that. I'll need some masher do and apathy, and then uh, sort of lucky. Oh, I need to do this. Great. Now you should all be empty, yes? I don't think you're empty. Now you're empty. You threatened your husband, Connorberg. That's not too bad. You get the friar. Disrespected the koala. It was the opportunity of a lifetime. Harry Peters. Oh. Koalas are fucking weird. Scammed a possum, the voice in my head told me to. Oh. You know what? Scammer, you get greed. Stood too close to a giraffe and you were bored? That just seems like an apathy deal. Alright. Hmm. <laughs> I locked up a cheetah. That's malice! That's what that would be. Threatened your sister. I'll give you the pride. Uh, probed a swarm of bees no one could stop. Greed? Made a bad joke about a snail. Why not? <laughs> I don't know, Carol. Maybe this is why. Lunchtime! Okay. Prepared to go whip something up. Mashed potato balls for Loki. Alright. 
mashed potato bowl of boiled potatoes. Mashed potato balls. Ooh, that sounds good. D through A minus. Okay. Cook that. Oh, oh, there's an easy button to it. I didn't have to go through Loki to get to it. Oh, well. New dish done. Mashed potato balls. Perfectly rounded and shaped to perfection. Perfect. Except they're D rank, but still. Perfect! Continue. All right, Loki. Have some mashed potato balls. Finally, my food is here. Fantastic. Baked potato cubes. All right, well, oh, that's right. I do want to do this. So, you spied on your boss. You probably were greedy. You mauled a turkey. Why not? Finn! Turkeys are delicious. But yeah, we'll give you mallets. Peeked at a liger. You were jealous. Well, that is, that is either pride or greed, but I think I got someone in greed. Yeah, it's already used. Okay, I'll give you pride. Cheated on your grandmother? I'm not gonna touch that one. Not. So let's see. You want, you want baked potato cubes. Let's give you some baked potato cubes. Fantastic. All right, all right, all right, all right. Ah, uh, smothered a giraffe because life was hard. Ah, your malice. Smeared poop on a bat because life was hard. Okay, first of all, you're nasty. Give you pride. Spread rumors about an elephant, why not? There's a lot of why nots going on here. And I just got, got lucky with this one to fill here. Okay. French fries! My dear Loki wants french fries. Right, I already gave you the potato cube. The cubed potatoes. There, there's the french fries. There we go. Oh, level up! Hell yes! Level up from Loki. Great. Fantastic. Potato... Potato what? What? What am I looking at? Potato... Potato croquette? Uh, I got a decent amount of everything. We'll continue with the pit of judgment while this is going on. You need a malice. We need... Uh, I'll give you a pride. Uh, you can go anywhere, so I'll, I'll make you that. Uh, oh, perfect! Let's continue doing... That was spectacular. Mm, yes, thank you, Loki. I do appreciate when things are spectacular. Huh. Oh no! You're not high enough for my pride. All right. I can deal with this. There, see? Now I can throw you in malice and give you apathy. I'll send you to pride because I didn't have anyone in pride and send you to greed. And look at how much favor I... I have over double the favor I need. Last order. Mashed potato balls. So, sounds so good. Mm. All right. We'll just get everyone in to where they need to go. And present as tribute. All right. Completed the objective. Earn and keep 50 favor. Yeah, I did it. Okay. Sinner sorted, 35. Dishes cooked, six. Orders complete, six. I could make an Order 66 joke, but I'll do that maybe if I hit 66 on Orders Complete. Favor earned, 133. Starch, 10% of favor, 13. All right. Okay. I could stay. 
But I'm going to call that here. Okay. This game is totally different from kind of what I expected, but that's also based completely on a weapon shop. And you know what? I'm going to do this. Oh, game save. Perfect. So let me go to the start menu. Yes. I do like that sound to it. I want this soundtrack. I love it so far. It's It's got a nice beat to it. So, this game based on completely from a weapon shop is quite different. But it's absolutely fun. I'm not saying that just because it was given to me for free. This is my genuine honest opinion. I'm loving this game. It's it's another one of those that is going to be immediately addictive and Oh god, it's ludicrously fun. It really is as ludicrously fun. Because I get to sit in my nice comfy chair reading about these people, looking at their stats, and judging them. Ooh, it's like jury duty, but better! In full disclosure, I've never been on jury duty, and I don't sit back and judge people. But these are potatoes. So I'm gonna judge the potatoes. Alright, so, the long and the short of it, get this game, it's fun, and it's, it's got a charm to it with the, the current animation style, and Daylight has always had great, great references everywhere, so, absolutely thank you for the Steam key, and I wish you the best with this, oh, uh, I'm gonna go play it for a couple more hours while... Oof. Yeah. I'm gonna go play it for a couple hours after I get it edited and while it's uploading. So, I want to thank you for giving me your time today so I can throw it out that window over there. And if you like this video for some reason, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you're new here, why not subscribe? What's the worst that could happen? Anyways, thank you, and I hope all of you have a wonderful day. Hey guys, once again thank you so much for watching. If you want to see me finally take out that fallen panzer in Sunder, click over to the left. And if you want to see the video that YouTube thinks you would like, click over to the right. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I'm really glad I pushed it up from Halloween and from, from Saturday morning.